Hello friends, myself Chandrasekhar. Today we are going to discuss about fundamentals to prerequisites, question and answers and session. Okay, how it is going and how to complete prerequisites for fundamentals to that and all I will tell you in this session. Uh, before going to that, if you are uh, new to Copado and if you are uh, don't know how to register fundamentals one or how to register for Copado session, I have mentioned the video links in the description. Okay, please go through the videos and uh, you will get to know how to register for Copado training and uh, Copado voucher and how to complete prerequisites for fundamentals one and all, all the details I have mentioned in the description videos. Okay, please go through that and uh, we'll start the video here. Okay, if you are uh, completed your first certification in Copado, since fundamentals one, after completion of fundamentals one only, you can able to write fundamentals two. Okay, let's start the video. If you are going to write a fundamentals to exam, you need to complete before all the prerequisite courses. If you don't know how to check the what are the prerequisite courses and all, just then uh, directly go to training calendar. Okay, under training tab, there is a training calendar. Go to that. There you will get the details like when the Copada is going to provide a new session for fundamentals one, fundamentals two or consultant whatever it is it depends on country itself okay basically we have on january 9th for usa and uh, 10th for uh, fundamentals one india okay what is the where is the fundamentals two for uh, india here it is uh, 19th january i am just clicking on register see here prerequisite courses are showing apex testing and conflict resolution these are the main two things we need to complete before going to uh, uh, register for uh, fundamentals to exam okay or fundamentals to exam session okay once uh, once we completed that these things then we can go to register here and once you register you can able to attend the session at the end of the session they will share the voucher worth the 250 dollars that voucher you can uh, apply for your exam and you can complete the fundamentals to exam also okay that voucher is not applicable for only fundamentals too. If you want to do fundamentals one, you can implement, I, I mean, you can apply that code to fundamental one also. Okay. But robot test, uh, robotic testing and consultant, it will not work. Why? Because these are the $500 vouchers. Okay. Especially for see this uh, training session, there is a $699 value dollars. Okay. For fundamentals one and fundamentals two, you can use a $1 for both the things okay fundamentals one i have already registered sorry class is full and uh, fundamentals two india is not at full okay if you click on register you you will get the things what are the things you need to complete it okay apex testing and conflict resolution okay we need to complete these two for that go to training channel calendar academy go to all learning classes see all learning under all learning all academy courses is there first one click on that here search for apex testing See, Apex testing not yet have started or registered. Okay, let's register this one and uh, we need to complete the first thing. Apex testing. Then we will go for uh, conflict resolution. Okay, registration completed successfully. Then click on launch. I suggest you to please go through all the things. Don't skip anything. But I am doing video purpose, right? So I am just uh, skipping these uh, things. Come down, click on done. It will show another uh, activity. See, introduction to Apex. Click on next. At the end, click on done. But I am personally suggesting you please go through all the things. Then only you can able to complete the fundamentals to session. Okay. You need to complete all these modules, plan activities. Okay. 
click on next there is a video please watch this video it will be shown the practical things how to implement how to do the task how to use a story works how to code test how to check the new apex class in the dev environment and now he wants to commit it on a user story. okay just i'm skipping the video please watch all the things Once it is completed, it will uh, show the next option. Click on next. And uh, here, uh, please read all those things and click on done. Click on next. Done. next finally the test is came in the sense we need to test our knowledge okay for that please read all those questions if you are going through all the above mentioned prerequisite courses plan activities if you read all those things then you can easily clear this mm, for this uh, fixed class uat environment next then running the fixed dishes Okay, click on manage Apex test in the user store record. Click on next. When can users pay minimum Apex code coverage in the user story environment? And uh, Rob has total Apex recording. They should be for reach production. How can he accomplish with Copado? I think this one uh, okay let's submit 75% is required okay I got 75% exact 75% finish once you finish the apex test then go for conflict resolution for that you need to go to follow the same process training and our academy all learning and all academy courses search here conflict resolution see it's showing conflict resolution. Click on register. And then launch. If anyone wants fundamentals 1, I can uh, help on that. Fundamentals 2, I'll uh, tell the date when I'm going to start on that. If anyone wants fundamentals 1, Please reach out to me. I'll uh, click on that. Okay. First, it's introduction itself. It's starting with video. Please complete all those things. Pre-manual step. I mean, pre-activity, plan activities. Then only it will go for a test knowledge. Knowledge, your, test your knowledge. Okay. And I suggest you to personally, please go through all the things. Don't skip video or uh, anything. Just uh, read out all those things. But I'm uh, skipping this video purpose. Okay, first one is start completed. Click on next. <laughs> then click on done. Click on next. Read all those things and click on done at the end. And uh, click on next.
and uh, it's a video please read all those things and uh, watch the video here they will clearly tell how it's work auto performs a different auto result save the changes he is committed to support user i'm just skipping the video and there is a video auto resolution for this okay once it is once it is done then it, they will show for manual resolution auto resolution and manual resolution, resolution when you work in the copado when you are deploying to production or you may get some uh, resolutions merge conflicts okay for merge conflict resolution purpose there is a two kind of task one is auto resolve and the manual resolve that is the, they are showed in these two videos okay please go through that and i am clicking on next okay at the end click on done and click on next conflict resolution done if you clearly read all those things and if you listen all the videos properly you can crack the fundamentals to certification i am sure but we need to focus on things for if you want to register for fundamentals one and uh, how to register for copado and all i have mentioned the description videos please go through that one more video here that is a uh, online conflict resolution your class whose per i'm skipping the video feature and click on next and finally test your knowledge for some components a manual conflict so is a better approach for which metadata type is good idea to use a exclude form auto resolve we can use apex triggers and uh, uh what plurals will not work okay layouts and apex classes click on next when is the online conflict resolution is triggered after detecting a merge conflict between a feature branch and promotion branch after deploying a update on a code operation class the like you are notice it some previous functionality was overridden by an auto resolve complex functionality how can you prevent this issue for all your promotions uh field pipeline destination or credential field in users destination or destination or only can fix it rob has a uh, enabled on the conflict resolution he has a uh, what are the type of conflict resolutions process we can have with the copad auto resolution and manual resolution click on submit Okay, here we have passed with the eighty percent of score. Okay, now prerequisite courses are completed. Then again, go for training, training calendar, and uh, register for fundamentals two session. Then obviously you'll get a Zoom link and attend for Copado session. Then uh, you can uh, implement that code. Okay, click on register. I would suggest to please register before. Uh, fulfilling the class see now in india most of the people are trying to complete the copado session so almost class is full okay my registration is completed successfully anyway you will get one email 
for that for that and uh, there uh, you can join the call okay this is the for fundamentals to prerequisites courses and the fundamentals one and copyright registration things and all i have mentioned in the description please go through that and if you like this video please like share and subscribe my channel thank you